All right, so uh, Gamescom just happened. I watched most of it. Real quick, Marvel Snap got an update. Uh, I haven't played Marvel Snap in a really long time, but it's always meant to, it was always meant to be like a mobile game, but then they put the mobile game version of it on Steam, and it was just kind of like the center of the screen. So they just recently updated the entire client for PC. We're going to take a look at what the, what the PC client looks like now. I think it looks way better. And they got uh i i'm pretty sure this this feels like the same people who made um like like valorant music videos for i mean uh riot music videos for valorant and, and league of legends but i don't know if it's the same like group i didn't like look that up but it sounds like it and it feels like a valorant music video give you a little intro to get you hype good stuff please sign in again all right I'll slice apart the competition with the docking docking I don't know who docking is in the new premium season pass yeah how far is their their pass their pass is like ongoing like forever or something like that right to like as, as long as you play and as if you play a ton then you'll just you'll just get these like free rewards so like the the whole the whole feel of of the thing is better now like before you used to have to slide left and right and like it just didn't feel good to play it on pc but it looks a lot better now like a, a proper a proper client for the game Level 217. I did play this. I did play this a significant amount, but I'm sure that friends of mine who play this game are probably like at level 1000 or something like that. Uh, daily missions over here. This is the big in Japan season pass. Oh, is this, this is Silver Samurai? Oh, wait, is Silver Samurai a card in this pass? Magneto card? Move all opposing three and four cost cards to this location. Let's see what other cards are here. This is this the new avatar. Mystery variant. What other cards are here? Is this a card back? X23? Iceman. Give a random card in your opponent's hand plus one cost. Another card back. The dock. Dark. Dock. I want to say Darken, but Dokken. I don't know. I don't know who it is. I'm going to have to look that up later. What does he do? Uh, add the more. Mo Add the more Masa shard to your hand. Okay, so that's 50. So it's like what? Two, three cards? It's like three cards and then like the mystery variants. Titles, credits, etc. What's in the shop? Cap, the welcome bundle. Cap welcome bundle for three bucks. Captain Marvel Storm One Punch Women. <laughs> A one punch man reference for the daily offer premium mystery variant i feel like if you get a premium mystery variant or you get the highest rarity of a card they should like have a place where you can like like kind of like destiny doesn't i guess i understand why destiny does it the way they do because you still have to buy it you just get the you get i think you get access to buy it if you do a certain thing like if you beat a certain rage you get like a rage jacket or something like that but like they have a place where you can you can have access to buy like uh a, a 
physical version of the card like maybe not a paper version of the card but like a i don't know like a metal like a metal version of the card or an aluminum version of the something something really like nice to, to be able to like and it's only like a couple bucks like maybe it's like ten dollars or something like that or like five bucks you pay for the actual version of the the highest rarity card variant once you have it in your once you have it in your collection something like that you know be cool because like otherwise it doesn't really feel like amazing to like have like a um super rare version of a card um in a digital card game because it's digital like you can't hold it like you can't you can't trade it you can't sell it you can't you can't do anything with it it's just you just it, you're, it just makes your deck look cooler like that's pretty much it okay this is the collection the collection page looks oh it's much much better to 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 go around and, and look at all the cards and stuff that you have and this is the the starter drawing that i made this is the one the one i was using pretty much um mostly yeah this is the one i was mostly using destroy synergy this is like just stuff that i was testing out and seeing what seeing what it was but i think yeah this was my main uh my main one here all right for good measure for good measure let's let's uh let's play with this old deck that will probably get blown out <laughs> let's let's play a match let's play a match here all right quick silver Yandu. What does Yandu do again? Destroy the top card of your opponent's deck. That's good for me. Uh, after turn three, transform all cards here into the Hulk. Uh, we're going to play that. Like, we're, you, you, you just have to play a bunch of cards here, right? Plus two power for each other card you have here. It's gonna change. So I can't use Wolfbane there. This card is your only card here. Once this is in your hand, you can see an unrevealed locations. Destroy the top card of your opponent's deck. Okay, I want to know what this is. That's gonna change that anyway. Oh, once it's in your hand, you can see unrevealed locations. Cards played here have a 25% chance to be destroyed. Oh, okay, okay. After each turn, cards here fight. Destroy the weakest ones. Oh, that took too long. I'm gonna put this, I'm gonna put Namor there. Move all your highest power cards to this location. I think I'm a snap. I, I don't remember if I should or not. Okay, I'm gonna put Namor here. Or, where's my timer? Okay, we got, I'm gonna put Wolf's Bane here to power up these, uh, Master nice to do discard a card from your hand. Uh, Amor is gonna go here.
give give three other friendly cards plus two power. Add another sentinel to your hand. Uh, I'm gonna put sentinel here. I'm gonna put iron heart here. I think I'm I think I'm good. The opponent retreated. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Cause they couldn't be my name or and they couldn't put anything here probably that was high enough to um to beat this. So Yeah. It's pretty good. So we got our win. We got our we got our two our two things for rank progress. We can level this up. 3D. 3D. Right, I'm liking the new client. I like the new client. I'll have to. I'll have to play some. I have to play some. But I've been playing a lot of stuff. I mean, well, I'm not necessarily a lot of stuff, but I've been playing a few things a lot. So I've been playing a lot of Street Fighter. I've been playing uh, um, off stream and like not really recording anything for it uh, i've been playing a lot of pokemon mmo or poke mmo um, uh, I'm, I'm close to my fourth badge um in that game and then uh, i've been playing a lot of genshin impact um genshin impact and poke mmo i've been playing it on steam deck and i don't know it just makes the game much more playable having like a dedicated like uh, handheld to play it on uh and it's not normally available like you can't just go into steam and download genshin impact or um or poke mmo you have to install it a very specific way using the desktop side of steam deck but once you get it all you know set up it it feels really good to play so i've been playing a lot of that and then you know street fighter and uh, also been playing Baldur's gate with a friend of mine he bought me Baldur's gate so um Baldur's gate 3 we were playing that game too so all right yeah maybe i can squeeze in some uh some marvel snap here and there and uh and play on the new client see if i can like level up and get some new cards and maybe find out what people what decks people are running but it's a pretty cool game to play like daily because of how the uh, the, the areas work where it's like it changes the areas and changes the things that you you run into and changes some of the, like the, the daily i think they have like daily um uh areas or or like, like i don't forget what they call them daily zones or whatever on the on the uh play field so uh yeah that's pretty marvel snaps looking good it's looking good uh win a location with four cards that was the hulk area um and then play one cost cards five play five one cost cards this one is draw 50 cards we've drawn 22 and then uh play four cost cards play four four cost cards so i probably will do that um but yeah the, the client's looking great if you haven't tried out the client yet the new client for steam try it out uh, i did have to uninstall I, I didn't see anywhere to update or i didn't see it I have an update so i just i just uninstalled the game from my my computer and then reinstalled it reinstalled the updated version of it so um, if you if you're looking or you're having the same issue where you keep opening it and it's the old version just uninstall it and reinstall it. it's only like three three and a half gigs it doesn't really take that long to install so uh yeah all right peace